Hi everyone, I just wanted to do a quick video to show some of the benefits of becoming a MassBot member. So, the most obvious one, when you enter the membership code and, and press go, is that all the adverts on the site will, will disappear and you can enjoy MassBot without any ads. Um, and then, on the top of all that, there's these five little buttons down the side, uh, and these are all members only resources. So the first one is CPD slides, if you click on that, you access all my... Um, sort of catalogue of CPD. Now I deliver these face to face or, or online and you can download the PowerPoints just by clicking on them or there's a OneDrive link there to, to download them all as well. So there's all my CPD. Uh, the second tab is videos. So these are the maths, the mini math spots videos. So these are little CPD videos on particular areas of maths. Now I'll get onto this later, but all these are linked to objectives in the uh, MathSpot curriculum as well. And again, this is a growing library of videos of how to use the various tools in MathSpot. Again, with a OneDrive link to download them all. Uh, the third one is the TAS. So you, you, you may have seen the 1001 MathSpot TAS project. Now it's becoming quite big now. I'm not sure how many tasks there are exactly, but I've, I've split them out into algebra, geometry, number and stats and so on. And if you click on each one, and then they're further subdivided. These are OneDrive links to the PowerPoints here, you can see, into categories as well. So you've got like fra factors, fractions, and so on. Uh, so you've got PowerPoints, editable PowerPoints of these tasks as well. Uh, the fourth one, and this is the new and constantly improving uh, MathSpot curriculum, is the whole of maths from sort of like primary to the end of secondary, organised by stage. Now I've gone with stage rather than year, because... Um, I'm not a fan of saying year, you must have done this by year six, so I've called them stage, but essentially this is what a year one child uh, should be able to do and, and so on. You can filter them by uh, topic or by unit as well, so if I just type in say maybe directed number, this is the directed unit, uh, number unit, and if I click on an objective, it'll show you where it sits in, in the prerequisites of all the things to do with that particular topic. So this is directed number and it starts with counting backwards through zero, uh, and, and moving through the topic. And now, any resources which I think are useful to teach these particular objectives are linked underneath with the interactive resources. So you can think of good things like two color counters and uh, structured variation grids. And in addition, those um, MathSpot videos that I mentioned as well, uh, any sort of related MathSpot videos, mini MathSpot videos, are related to the objectives as well. So there's directed number. Uh, just search for your unit down there or you've got a little sort of contents thing down here as well. This is relatively new and I'm constantly tweaking and adding and changing objectives around and I reckon in um, a few months time it's going to be a really useful resource. And then the final one I've not shown is, is the mass funnel. Now this is a sort of half termly regular meeting online that we have uh, and we discuss a particular maths topic. So the last one that we discussed was on bar modelling. There'll be a new one announced soon. And here are links to the threads uh, that, that we spoke about during the session. So these are just like a little online, an online uh, sort of social event where, where we chat about maths. So hopefully, you got um, just to summarise, you've got the ad-free code and all these five areas which are constantly being added to and improved upon. Uh, and hopefully you'll find that that's useful. So if you fancy it, you can just click on the membership tab and you can choose an option here and sign up. So hopefully you found that useful. Uh, thank you very much.